Uh, my name is Ola Conley Taiwo. I've been a bus driver for with Arriva for over six years. The reason why I support the National Autistic Society is because um, I've got a son who was diagnosed as being autistic from the age of three, four years old. My name is Elise Lawrence. I work for Arriva London. I'm a bus driver. I've been driving for about six years. I contribute to the payroll giving scheme. My money goes to Sierra Leone to help children under the age of five um, with diseases and diarrhea. Right, my name's Pete Middleton. I'm one of the area controllers for the north area, although we do go into the south. Um, I've been dealing with payroll giving since it first started. My name's Steve Sobers. I've been working at Enfield as a bus driver and I've been a, a driver for a number of years. And um, I've been contributing to the payroll giving program. My name is Sharon Barry. I joined Arriva in 2004. I was driving buses initially and then decided that I wanted to work in the office. So I joined customer services. I chose the stroke organisation um, relatively because my father had three strokes before he eventually was taken by cancer. My name is Mr. Jain Tilal Chohan. I started at Palmer's Green Bus Garage when I was only 18 years old and I worked here for two years as a conductor, then applied for a driver, and ever since there, I've been working here as a driver at Palmer's Green. Uh, we were given a list of what we'd like to do, and, and I chose Bernardo's for the simple reason that I've come from a, a fairly stable family background, and when I went to what is classed as senior school, which is like 11 years onwards, our school was integrated with a, a local home down the road. And it wasn't until later on in life I suddenly realised that I went home at half past three, quarter to four, and those kids were going home to a home and they didn't have a family life. So when we had a chance of, of giving only a few pounds a week at the time, after I took the chance of doing it. I decided to, because there were a few people that come around, charity people, and they asked, would you be happy to do a payroll charity donation? So I said, yes, it would be very nice. Well, the lady from um, the charities were here and she asked me about payroll giving and showed me a list of who I can support. I chose Save the Children and it basically took seconds. Um, she, all she took was my details and she did the rest. I didn't have to do anything else. And a few weeks later, I got all my information in the post to give me confirmation that I have signed up. And I think it's an excellent idea because it gives us the drivers an opportunity to give back to charities that really need our help. And the thing about it is, it's been, I've been giving for so long, I've actually totally forgotten all about it. So when I was asked, um, just to say a few words, I think it's absolutely brilliant. I think all, all drivers, if you're thinking about it, do it. There's some charities personally for me that uh, give me a chance to contribute to. It's the Prostate Cancer UK. Uh, Macmillan, these, these, ca these charities deal with cancer and uh, I had a family member who's a prostate cancer survivor and also there's the NSPCC because I've got two children and that's very dear to my heart. Uh, I support t f quite a few charities through payroll. One of them is RSPCA, that's uh, Cancer Research, St Bernardo's. RSPCA one was always been because my father-in-law passed away a long time ago. He was always keen on animals, dogs, and he always used to take his dog to church as well. That is unusual, but he used to make the dog pray as well. When he had the strokes, it was, but there was very little known about it. Um, it seems nowadays even more people are suffering from it, and it affects a lot more people. And I believe that they need more funding to help to find a cure. The, the old process of um the application and everything too was very quick, very swift and straightforward. I've been contributing for about a year now and to be honest I don't miss the money and when I look at it, when I do remember, it makes me happy because Save the Children is all over the world but I was happy to be given the choice to choose Sierra Leone for my donation. The National Autistic Society have been, um, as I said, the backbone of support from my son from the age of um, from the age of three upwards, that's over 16 years of support from them. And through telephone calls and 
supporting through other bodies as well, you know, referrals and all that, you know, and um, it's been of great um, significance and of great help for the family as well. Payroll giving is an easy thing to do. Um, it's taken out of your wages. I would recommend it to anyone if they, if they wish to give money to charity without having to consciously place their hand in their pocket. They know that either every week or every month a small amount of money will be taken out of their wages. They won't even notice it's gone. And you don't. That is it.